Hey guys, it's Emma. Today I have a really quick review on a product that I've been loving ever since I purchased it. I went to Sephora I think a week or two ago and I needed to pick up some things and I picked up the Hourglass Arch Brow Sculpting Pencil and I have been using this eyebrow pencil ever since. I'm in love with it. So I wanted to kind of show you guys how I use it and I wanted to give you a brief review about this product. So if you're interested, continue watching. I'm going to read you what Hourglass claims this eyebrow pencil does. They say it's a mechanical brow pencil with a unique triangular shaped tip that combines the benefits of powder pencil and wax in one to create naturally defined brows. I'm speechless when it comes to this pencil. First of all, the packaging is very luxurious it's very nice looking and sleek it's it's like a metal packaging this eyebrow pencil goes for thirty two dollars which it's expensive but my very first eyebrow pencil that i used was a ysl brow pencil and that was forty dollars but that was also like a pencil sharpener um eyebrow pencil and those tend to last longer this is a mechanical brow pencil the reason i really like this brow pencil is because of the unique tip so I don't know if you can tell, but the tip of this eyebrow pencil is very unique because of its shape. It's a triangle eyebrow pencil, which to me just blows my mind with the fact that this even works. I love this eyebrow pencil for three reasons. One, because of the formula. I feel like the formula is very creamy and it lets you create a really nice defined brow. I'm one that doesn't really like overly pigmented eyebrow pencils. One, because if you have a really pigmented eyebrow pencil and you mess up, it's hard to get rid of that then. I like how you can gradually build up the product, and that's what you can do with this. My second reason that I love this is because of the shape of the eyebrow pencil. I have never come across an eyebrow pencil that is a triangle shape. I mean, it's crazy. But I think the unique shape allows you to create such a beautiful brow. I like to use the side of the eyebrow pencil to trace out the eyebrow first and then I like to go in with a thinner end to draw on the tail because you want your tail end of your eyebrow to be the thinnest and the smaller end of the eyebrow pencil really lets you do that and then you go back in and just finish tracing it out to create this kind of inner portion of my eyebrow the start of the eyebrow I like to go in with the base and create short hair like strokes to mimic um, eyebrow hair. And the third reason that I love this eyebrow pencil is because of the longevity and how long you can wear it for. When I wear eyebrow pencils, I have to touch up throughout the day because my tail end tends to fade away, which is very annoying because my eyebrows weirdly shaped. I kind of fake a little part of my tail end. So I can wear this eyebrow pencil for 16, 18 hours and it wears incredibly. I have very long days, so I wear my makeup for about an average of 14 hours a day. But I wore this for 16 hours yesterday, and it was incredible. My eyebrows looked on point at 2 in the morning. It's very hard to find blonde eyebrow pencils, just in general, even drugstore and high-end. And Hourglass, their arch brow pencil line, this line of their eyebrow pencil, they have two blonde shades. They have platinum and they have blonde. Platinum was a bit cool tone for me. My hair is very warm. So I wanted my eyebrows to have a warm undertone. I really like the range of colors that they have. Also this spoolie is awesome. It evenly disperses the product throughout the brow. Enough of me rambling about this awesome product. If you want to see the demonstration then continue watching. So I'm going to go in with the side of the eyebrow pencil just because I like to use the side to kind of map out where I'm going to place my brow place my brow, where I'm going to draw on my brow. Just like that. So we have the top of the brow. Then I'm going to use the tip, the smaller end of the eyebrow pencil, to draw on my tail. And then go back in with the side of the eyebrow pencil and fill in the end. I like to use the side of the eyebrow pencil to fill in the brow as well. Then I'm going to go underneath and map out the brow using the side of the eyebrow pencil. So the only thing that really needs to be done right now is this inner portion of my eyebrow. And to do that I like to take the thicker end of the eyebrow pencil and I just like to pull the hairs up. And 
Then I'm going to take the spoolie and blend this together. I really like the spoolie of this eyebrow pencil because I feel like it evenly disperses the product throughout the brows. So after I do one quick brush, I'm going to go and touch up the eyebrow, kind of fix areas that I didn't like. And I'm just using the side of the eyebrow pencil. I really like to use the side of it and I like to use the tip and the end to create brush strokes. So this is what the completed product looks like. As you can see, the eyebrows just look very put together. They look very natural and groomed, which is what I love about this pencil. So overall, I love the formula of this eyebrow pencil. I love the shape of the eyebrow pencil itself. The spoolie that it comes with is incredible. The range of shades for this eyebrow pencil are amazing. They have two blonde shades, which is very important. And the longevity and the wear of this eyebrow pencil is amazing. I'm sorry that this video was all over the place. I just wanted to get on here really quick and talk to you about this eyebrow pencil. I'm in love with it. I will definitely repurchase it. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you have not already. If you have tried this Hourglass Arch Brow Pencil, comment down below and let me know what you think about it. And don't forget to follow me on my social media. I post on Twitter a lot. I'm on there all the time talking about makeup and new products. And feel free to ask me any type of beauty questions that you have because I'm there for you. I'm there. And yeah, I will see you in my next video. Bye.